going on guys welcome to another episode today is going to be a long and interesting one we are starting off a series um, the boat behind me we are going to be delivering this boat to Newport so I'm going to bring you guys along for the ride along for the process I'll show you as much as I can welcome to your next adventure So one of the pros of living close by is that you can pick up last minute gear and stuff like that so based on the setup I'm gonna try and maybe get some work done on the on the on the way up so I can stay on top of the editing at least emptying my cards and stuff like that so I just got my keyboard my mouse but um, yeah basically today is the last little bit of touching it up tying down wiping off before we leave check out with immigration clear out and then we off again this is yeah we might hang out for a little bit and then set sail but for now just cruising water tanks are full so yeah so i'm gonna get some lunch last little meal on land and then go chill out on the boat i probably record this later but basically the trip is leaving from st martin sxm and we're gonna go all the way up to Newport, Rhode Island. I've done this trip before with the same crew. Well, not the same crew. We had the, the girl that's on board. I haven't sailed with her before. With everybody else, I've sailed with them before, but on a different boat. So this is the first time on this particular boat, but not the first time doing the particular trip that we're on. So we'll see if it's uh, as smooth as the last time. But this boat is a bigger boat than the last one. The last boat was 68 feet. And this boat is 110, I believe. So it should be pretty interesting. Organizing a little bit. This is a little bit more appropriate and accessible. Yeah, stuff like that, like making sure safety equipment is accessible. So I'm just gonna give the steering and stuff like that once over. So all of these cables, making sure there's no fraying. Yeah, so like all of this water here needs to come out. Continuing the visual check. Making sure all the cabling in there is in good condition. So when we're not out in the ocean. Those are pins in there. Those are there. Check. Oh no, my dog touched the water. Okay, this is an autopilot unit. The rudder right sensor. The 
tin to the helm. It turns. So this is hooked up to the big wheel shaft, big sprocket, big chain. Help stairs the boat. Make sure all of this stuff is good. Pins are in. All of this cable looks good. time on the, the mechanical side of the water maker so if you can fill it up while you're at the dock most boats do so You need the screwdriver back?
we're gonna close off this video today here. Um, we have an anchor outside of Simpson Bay. Very eventful shakedown <laughs> today. We a little bit of Murphy's Law in play. What could have gone wrong went wrong. But we're fixing everything now, so plan on heading out at about 8 o'clock. So we're about to have dinner. We just had our safety briefing to basically get us up to speed with all the fire extinguishers, all the safety equipment, um, what to do in case of certain emergencies, which is super important because once we head off, no one's coming to save us, at least not immediately. So we gotta be on top of our game all the time or as best as possible. So yeah, as always, I leave my videos off with something positive. And today's positive message is be prepared for the opportunities you want. I always preach this, make sure your stuff is in order, set your goals and know what you need in order to accomplish those goals. Thanks for watching. I'm gonna eat, get some rest. See you guys in the next episode. Later.